Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to 7 Days to Die in Project Zomboid. We got our little house halfway built here. We got the garage, we got the storage area, a little bit of a roof. We got some kitchens, some uh, bedroom and bathroom, and then there's going to be a little bit of like a hangout and entertainment area here. We got a few survivors left. The last episode was pretty brutal. Um, just me and I think three or four others. We got the farm going as well. We got to water I think, everything, I think. I was hoping it was going to rain, but... Um, we got all of them working on disposing of these bodies. We got the man, the myth, the legend, Survivor Lewis here. We still got to kit him out with something. I wonder if there's any cops or anything over here. We could maybe put some of that on for him, give him some armor and a leather jacket. He don't even need the armor. He was falling out without anything on. And that pool cue. Um, I think he also got, like, trampled by a bunch of zombies, and he just blasted right through us. So props to that guy. He's a beast. Next Rambo over here. I actually might name him, like, something cooler. All right, um, not too much going on in all these bodies. I Maybe eventually I'll, like, strap, uh, scrap all the uh, stuff for the leather and everything, but not super worried about it. Uh, let's give him a break. There we go. All right, there we go. We got him decked out. Rambo Lewis here gave him a leather jacket, police thing, a beret, and, uh, one other thing. Um, today we need to get some gasoline, so I'm thinking... A lot of room in here. We need these gas cans and we need to get them filled fast. Got five of them. I guess really not much going on in here. Don't really want to sacrifice somebody else, so I think I might just go at it alone. Maybe I can even find another vehicle and uh, work on that from there. <laughs> Trying to think of some other good ideas, but I just know there's a lot of zombies in the area, so hopefully my axe holds up as well because my axe is almost broken. But we're going to see how it goes. Got a couple boys over here. I think I might use up this knife. Uh oh, where's my knife? I was just using it. What happened? What the heck? Did it break or something? It's a little bit strange. The axe is nice and strong now, boys. I've been leveled up my uh, axe skill and my strength. There we go. Yeah, I really don't know where my knife went. That's kind of annoying. Anyways, well, we got the axe as long as it doesn't break. I had it in my sheath, but I guess it just doesn't want to be there anymore. Uh, I was wondering if maybe I could lure them all in one spot and then just kind of lose them. I don't want to deal with so many of them. Oh, that's right, boys. I found this pickup truck over here and I found the key for it. I don't think it has any, any uh, fuel, though. Okay, and we got some friends over here, so we're going to have to take these guys all out. Come on, boys. Let's go. Ooh, that guy's got a knife. Maybe I can use that. Ooh, and a machete. Nice. All right. I'll take those. I want a machete. There we go, they're down. Oh, it's a bunch of yes. Ooh, woodcraft ones. Those are good. Ooh, there's a lot of guys in this place. A lot of boys. Try out my new machete. Oh yeah, my axe is almost down. That sucks. All right, let's close that up. Grab those. See if there's anything good over here. A trench knife. That's pretty sweet. All right, we'll take that. And the showing kit will take the stuff out of there. Trench kit. Trench knife. That sounds really cool, though. I did add a couple more um, mods for tools and... Not tools, um... Like melee weapons and something else. So I think some armor. So we can armor up our team. Nothing in there. Let's check out what this looks like. Oh, I'm in the pack. Yeah, so it needs some gas. But if we get some gas, we'll be able to drive it. So that'll be pretty sweet. But we need to have a little smoky smoke real quick too. I 
just walk right through them. Yeah, there's a ton of boys over there. Let's see if there's anything in here. Maybe a little bit of gasoline. Nothing in there. Siphon gasoline. Look at that. I like that. Take all these guys out. Nice. Those guys are all down for the guy. I like this little, uh, this little, uh, kukuri. Is that what it is? A tactical kukuri? Alright, now we can siphon some fuel out of this guy. Is it open? Okay. Let's see how much is in here. Where if we get like a full? Oh, we got one or two, I think. Definitely better than nothing, though. We can definitely fill up the truck up a little bit. Ooh, there's also a storage thing right there. A trailer. Let me mark that down. Right, there's the gas station. Let's uh let's go in this little shed here, take a little breather. Of course it's not open. And maybe we'll have a snack. Ooh, there's a generator in here too, boys. Look at that. Alright. Alright, we'll sit here. We will have a snack. I think I have, yeah, I have some soup here. I can eat that. We got, ooh, a large gas can. Alright. We're fucking zooming now, boys. Okay, what about this shelf? Or is that is that a shelf? Nope. We'll bolt mode mold. And the gas generator. Actually, you know what? That generator I could just bring right over to the gas station. Because I'm gonna need one anyways. So if I can clear it out, we'll be ready to rock and roll. Get that truck over here too. Maybe cut down these trees so I can come through here instead of going through the roads. I don't see too many yet. I know there are so many over here. I bet you over here there's going to be a bunch. Oh, yeah, there's definitely quite a few. I know last time I was shooting and that destroyed my uh, chances. Oh, this little farmer circus guy. Alright, there's a few of them down. Oh, there's another one. This is a red guy. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Back up, buddy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, good. It's just a scratch. All right, I'm going to bandage up. That was close. I don't really know how it grabbed me so quick, little bitch. You little shit. All right, anyways, I wanted to grab that knife. And there it is. Little bo oh, these are boaters. Okay, a little boater hat. Somebody over here having a snack. Excuse me, sir. No snacks. This one's ready to take it right in the butt. There we go. They are all down for the count. Alright, so now I want to get over there, grab that generator, and bring it this way. Okay, and we'll plop this down right there. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Drop the generator. There we go. Add some fuel, all the fuel we got. And then we can connect it. Turn it on. Kill all these guys real quick. Turn it off. Looks like it's probably full then. Drop that. Drop that. Unless I can get this into this bag. There we go. Now nah, we are cooking. Ooh, these just not. That's okay. We'll just go fill up the truck real quick. I think it might be because my guy might be overweight with the gas. Oh, boys, he's here. Father Gabriel. Father Gabriel. Oh, there he is, boys. He's here. There's his machete and all his stuff. 
Don't worry, my friend, you'll be loved and missed. Some cigarettes, we might need those. I know there's a lot of zombies right over here, so I think I should... Ooh, a fault for... Nice. And some ammo. I think I might actually grab them all before we move, because if we start moving, they're just going to attract so many of them, so... Might not be good. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Another long blade level. Ooh, a bunch of snacks and stuff in here. Perfect timing. Alright. Tank is almost full. Let's see if it'll start. Oh, there it goes, boys. Look at it. Looks like it's in condition, too. Ooh, this thing's pretty quick. Nice. This right out front so we can load it up with all the loot. Let's go take out these Z's. We are getting a little sleepy too, so we're gonna make this quick. Ooh, you know what? I might have to cut some of these trees down. Let's grab that split and axe that we got back here. There we go. Come on, boys. Come on. It'd be a really good idea if we could like box this place in. Bring all these zombies coming. I want to clear enough out of them. Okay, right now it's looking pretty clear. There's a few down there, but they shouldn't bother. And this guy on. Ooh, there's even a light. Look at that. So fuel from the gas pump. There we go. Ooh, hi, boys. Okay, a couple of them. Yeah, it's going to make a little bit of noise. Oh, the boy got a little knife in his leg. Ooh, double. Oh, that guy's getting pretty sleepy. This axe is pretty good too. All that strength training is paid off. Let's have a little bit of a monsty real quick so we're not croaking as bad. Right over here, we got a couple more down here. We'll take these guys out. Blink. Nice. Put this in the truck, and there we go. We are full, boys. Sweet. Turn that guy off. Turn this off. And we can head home. So that is a job well done. And we got a cool new truck. So even better. I know there's probably a shit ton of zombies over here too. Oh, there, there they are. Leave me alone, leave me alone. Alright. Probably head up here and then we'll make it right and head back to shop. Alright. Just about home with our new truck with all the fuel that we need. We can part the truck inside here. go the lights off and shut her down nice i think there might have been a few zombies that were following us so which kind of sucks but shouldn't be no problem to take them out yeah here they come let's uh use that where is it put that on there and we'll turn this off so now we can see what we're doing You need to find some more friends so they can guard other parts of the wall. There we go. Alright, now we'll head home and go to sleepy time. Alrighty boys, I started working on the roof a little bit more and realized I have to put the roof on for the sink to be plumbable. So we're going to get this guy set up and have our first sip out of our sink. Look at that. Fill a canteen with some water. 
And we'll have a little bit of uh, a drink here. Nice. So we are off to a good start. We just got to finish up the base, finish up the roof. I used up all that. Oh, she's putting more out there. Sweet. I think there was a pile over here somewhere. So I might just grab that and finish up the roof real quick. Then we're not getting drenched. Oh, she was putting that pile right there. Okay, well, there is wood somewhere. There's two. <laughs> That's right. We got a lot of trees around. Um, there is something I want to do. I want to figure out what I can go and grab for electricity and get that smooth and so we get an oven in here. So I'm going to move all this stuff around and probably get some of that stuff ready. Let's see. Denise, I want to talk to you. Change your name to just Denise. There we go. Uh, let's see. Electrical. Almost level two. And we're going to need a screwdriver, which we should have a couple of, and we can use those other tools and why don't we have another snack before we leave I'm gonna go to nearby houses and uh do that oh this is empty all right there we go got all those set up how's the generator looking uh 39 fuel condition is fine why don't we just grab one of these now and uh we will fuel that bad boy up there 100 sweet all right and then this should probably have a little bit left yep nice we also want to find one of those, we got to go to like a, uh, one of those warehouses with all the loot. We keep that in there. This gun case, we'll take that out. Log on the satchels. These I'm just going to throw outside the gun case. I'll probably just put in the back. But yeah, we got to find like a warehouse so then we can grab some of those containers. Hopefully more racks. This is a rack right here. I have to set it up. And also, ooh, there's some food right there. And also the barrels, the big barrels from the fuel API mod, because then we can set up a little bit of a bulk storage for gasoline. It should be nice. Hold on to this stuff. Actually, no, I'm gonna put these in here because I think I could use those for some recipes. Actually, I'm just gonna save it in here because I wanna make like a little armory probably right out here and I'll put the, uh, wrapper in there look pretty cool be like a little prepper bunker and then this stuff i gotta figure out what i can do with this because i can't grab two of them please oh wait maybe i can there we go yep they got it okay i just have to kind of finagle the system a little bit can i do it like this no okay i gotta grab one first and then i can come over here and set it all up I wish this thing would go away. There we go. There we go. We got that set up. Nice. Looks nice. We'll take the truck out. This truck is pretty sweet. Uh, I wonder if it's going to get cleaned up. I think I might take uh, Mr. Rambo out too. Where is he at? Uh-oh. I hear some zombies eating. Uh-oh. Who's this? Okay, this looks like a... Oh, that's a big woman. Go to sleep. I do want this cowboy hat right here. It looks pretty sweet. Uh, let's find it first. Oh, actually, we could dismantle all these, too. That's a good idea. Maybe, you know what? Let's call everybody over here. We'll get them all to put the bodies in the same spot. And then we can... Oh, look at that. Perfect. Come here, boys. Lewis, give order. Oh, corpses. Denise. Call. I should just call everybody because I think I'm going to have to change the corpse radius anyways. Uh, big corpse. Drop corpses. Okay. There's a zombie right here. So any watches we can find, we can just dismantle them all and hopefully get some electrical skill up. Order pile corpses. Order pile corpses. Alright, so they'll all work on that while I'm gone. And we can head over. We may have to stay the night at somewhere because our fatigue's building up. Nice house right here. Let's check this out. And a little uh, shed too. 
This little dodge ram. Nice. Get the old axe out. Ooh, he's a little bit weak right now. What's going on? There it goes. There's the good old slap. Let's dismantle that guy. Also, our uh, our scratch healed. Took the bandage off to change it, and it was already healed, so that is good. Because that was a little bit worrying. That would have sucked. Because it kind of just got like cucked there. All right, let's take this zombie out before he breaks anything. All right, let's have a puff and off to bed for us. All righty, boys. It's the fifth ward on the way. We got about ten minutes in game. I do want to see if I can get these guys to return to base before anything happens. All right, here they come, boys. Let's uh, light this up. Well, that didn't really do much. Um, we got our axe repaired a little bit. Uh, I think we actually might have even swapped with one of those guys. We found a couple new survivors, and we recruited them. I think one of them already had an axe. And then also we have a baseball bat as a backup. Hopefully these are going to be enough. I'm not sure how many zombies are going to be. I think it's like 20 extra every night. So it's probably like 120 zombies. Let's see. Right now we didn't kill anything yet. We're at 150 or 1524. Let's see how that goes. Out of ammo already. Oh shit, there we loot. I did grab all the boxes of shotgun ammo that we have to try to take these boys out. Oh, so far, so good. We just kind of have to train them around. Like playing COD zombies. Them right over the fence here, kind of bottleneck them. I took out a few right there. Maybe we'll have to make like some kind of killing area. Firing squad. Ooh, look at that guy's armor. You got some kind of vest there. Oh, they broke through. head on over here on this side so we're getting close i think take the rest out with the axe i'm thinking save some ammo probably gonna need it we have to get to the police station soon maybe some kind of army hors d'oeuvres reserves or something like that there we go boys nice quite a few we took down let's check our kill count 1524 1708 1709. <laughs> oh, a fiberglass arrow. That's pretty sweet. See else we got going on around here? We're gonna do a little bit of a little bit of cleaning and some looting. If there's any watches or anything like that, we'll just force like that. Alrighty boys, we're back at the shop. We did a lot of work. Um, I just cleaned up my inventory a little bit. I got some new weapons from some of those zombies, tactical axe, machete, and knife. So those are all pretty cool. We got them all set up. Oop. We got one of them missing. This is a machete. Let's put the knife right there. There we go. Got that on a leg holster. 
We got the machete on the chest, we got the pistol, the shotgun, all that goodies, and we also got the tactical axe, that's a pretty sweet weapon. And uh, other than that, uh, we cleared everything out, we gotta get an electrical book so we can train our skill. Carpentry is maxed out, which is pretty sweet, we uh, are almost done with the base, we need to get the doors on here, and we need some metal sheets for that, and then the roof, uh, I guess you can't really tell. The roof, I think, yeah, there it is. Like, right here is still open. And then the whole garage needs to basically be done. But this is what it's looking like so far. we got a little spot here just to chill. Uh, I'm going to probably put some books and stuff right there. Maybe even a pool table would be pretty cool. I did have an issue. I had this bookcase here, and I wasn't able to see the generators, which is kind of silly because I, I'm on the other side of the wall, but whatever. Um, this is the bathroom. We had to move this, but everything is plumb, so we can have a little drink. Let's actually fill our canteens. There we go. We need to put the other one on our bottle slot. I'm not sure why it wasn't there. Um, we also we had the bathroom here, but we moved it because uh, we want to make put the armory over here. This is a little bedroom so far. Of course, we had to have the monsties. All the lights work and everything. Um, we have a little closet here. There we go. And then we just have a couch there. I'm gonna probably move that over to the living area. And then we're gonna put the armory right here. We just got a couple things so far. And then the kitchen didn't really change too much, I don't think. Um, in the garage here, we got this truck from, uh, I think this is the one that was in that front. It's still loaded full of stuff. We have to organize that. Actually, I'll take that because I can scrap that up. Um, can little cabinet here, some drinks and stuff like that for the garage. Got a couple of these guys up. There's a watch somewhere that's going off. Um, some storage on the way up still have these bags because I just have so much stuff I need to sort through and then some stuff over here for mechanics and we got our pickup here which is a uh, pristine condition we had them dropping off some logs 37 nice awesome uh, we also if you see up top we got this mod to show how many days we've survived which is a little bit nicer than this guy down here because sometimes it's like weird uh, you survive for one month and 14 days so um rather than I have to do the math it takes too much work um, this truck, I think, has got a lot of random stuff in it that I need to work on clearing out as well. I don't think I have any books for the... Ooh, ooh that's actually really good. I forgot I had that. Um, for the uh, electrics, electronics. So we're going to have to probably go find that. Um, and then we got our boy Rambo here, Rambo Lewis. And I don't think there's anything else going on in the area. We put a door here so we get in and out, and a door here for the farm. Um, probably going to put another gate on each side. Oops, in the corners here, top left and top right. And then down here just so we have some entries and exits, especially if we do the horde or anything like that. Uh, this is one of our new survivors, Douglas. He's been chopping the wood. And yeah, pretty good so far. Our guy is getting tired, so I think we're going to hit the hay. And then tomorrow we're going to work on organizing again and we got to go grab that electric book. So if you guys like, don't forget to leave a like for me. I really appreciate it. And hit the subscribe button if you want to see some more videos. Catch you in the next one.